Cost-wise, the more complex the part is, the better we look because it's an etching process. You're cutting everything at the same time, so we don't care whether there's one hole in there or a hundred holes in there. Uh, we're going to etch them all at once. I'm Pete Engel. I'm with New Cut Incorporated. We're a company that specializes in photochemical machining, thin metal parts, um, most alloys, mostly stainless steel, copper alloys, nickel alloys. Uh, that sort of thing. A lot of people have never heard of the process. It's an etching process, so we will start out with a sheet of metal. Uh, in this case, this is stainless steel. We coat it with this blue material, which we call photoresist. And then your tooling is just a piece of film, front and the back. You put it over the top, shine a uh, ultraviolet light on there, and it'll print that picture onto the film. Then you can run it through a developing solution and wherever the light didn't hit and cure it, it will wash away and you have a sheet that's masked. So then we can spray ferric chloride on here and it'll dissolve that exposed metal. And uh, all these little rings will cut out and you end up with a little, uh, little gear like this in this particular case. Most of the parts we do are from a half thousandth thick up to 32 thousandths thick. Uh, we've gone as much as an eighth of an inch in thickness on certain parts, um, but we're most competitive 32 thousandths and less. Material, most metals, uh, we got nickel alloys here, this one's molybdenum, uh, kovar for electronics, brass, copper, beryllium copper, this is phosphor bronze. That one's zirconium. We do a lot of prototype stuff. We do prototypes for stampers. Uh, we compete with laser. This part here is a shielding for a circuit board. Uh, it's suited well for our process because we put this half etched bend line in there. Uh, it's, it's just etched on one side halfway through and it allows the customer to get the parts flat, store them flat. And then at the point of use, you can just fold them and it'll bend up same size, same shape every time and it'll drop right into the assembly. Pretty much if you can draw it, we can make it. Uh, there's not many limitations as to geometry. Mostly we're working off of customers' drawings, but um, we can help with design. We can also add the secondary processes such as forming, heat treating, plating. So if, if you need the complete solution, we can get it all done. See us and other quality suppliers at d2p.com.